All right, guys, we got a breaker here. Um, it's bad. So it was tripped. We reset it by pushing it back. When we put it back up, sparks came. Well, this is what you get. So I'm going to do a quick overview here real quick. So you got your two main leads coming in. It's 110, 110. Um, those are live. You don't want to touch. Then you have your neutral bus bar here and here. And then you have a ground bus bar here. Um, so when you take this breaker off, you push it out here first, and then you can pull it off the back. So back here is never live. Up here is where it connects, and it will connect to this, um, this side of the bus. So if you look in here, you got that silver right there is where it clicks in that whole silver piece is live and hot but nothing else this is now dead i can do whatever i want so now what i'm going to do is unscrew this and pull the wire out I'll hold that Got it. all right so now that I got this breaker out, I'm gonna install the new one. And you can see where the wire will go in between those two plates. So we're gonna put that wire in there. And we're gonna tighten that down. Tug test, make sure it's in there secure. Now when we put this in, we're gonna put this on first the back side we're gonna make sure this is off and then once the back sides on we'll push on to the front okay now that it's in we'll turn it on if this arcs again that means that we have an issue in the circuitry down down field there see how it tripped so what we're gonna do now is we're going to go see why it's tripping this breaker. Now that other breaker should have done that same thing, but instead it just completely fried all together. So now that we got that fixed, we're gonna put the panel back on and we'll figure out what is tripping that breaker. 